guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's Betty Botter. And today we're going to be doing a different video than what I usually do. Usually I do like challenges and stuff like that. Or like little brother does this. Stuff like that, you know. But today we are going to be doing a story time. Oh, just to dress. Uh, don't mind my makeup. It's crown makeup. Yeah. But anyways, so I'm going to be doing a story time and it's going to be about broken bones, sprained bones, well, sprained, are they sprained bones? I guess, we're going to call them sprained bones, well sprains, <laughs> sprained bones, um, sprains, and yeah, this is my chair, this is a fat chair, I'm getting rid of it. Um, I was supposed to do this at 12 a.m. But then I didn't wake up to my alarm. And now it's 2. Well, 2 p.m. So, yeah. So, on with the video. So, the first ever bone that I broke, I believe I was 2. I, I was really young. I think I was like 2 or 3. Sorry, there's something with my eyes twitching. Um, and so, I was crying on the back of my couch. I had my sippy with me, and when I I slipped off the back of the couch, I, I wasn't hurt that bad. My sippy, I hit my elbow on my sippy, and it broke. And I, that's my first bone that I broke was my elbow. And then you wait all the way from being just a little baby, all the way to being in third grade. So I was like, I don't know, eight. I think I was nine. Yeah, because it was near the end of. Um, third grade, I was nine, and I was just talking to my mom, yeah. and I said fine, just talking to my mom, cause like she, so here's like our kitchen, and then here's like an entryway island, and another entryway, and I'm here, my mom's here cooking dinner, and I just fall backwards, nothing pushed me, like nothing happened, I just fell backwards, I tried to catch myself, and then I busted my wrist, and I was fractured, and then I had to have a cast on, and then okay so there's this kid that we're gonna call him lamppost and when he signed my cast he just wrote lamppost from all the way to like where it began because it was like ends like right here well it starts here and like ends here i don't know wait ends here um and so he writes lamppost from here all the way to like where my elbow is and he Wrote and I was just like, I think it was one of the ones where, no, maybe it was just like this. Yeah, it was just like from like here to like here, and he just wrote, lamp post. I just can't. Okay, next, it was a long while, was, and then in like fifth grade, when I was like 11, I think, 11 or 10, I think it was 10, I don't know. 11 or 10, I went, and I broke my toe, and I had to wear this for three weeks. I had to tape my, like, I broke my pinky toe, so I had to tape my pinky toe to the other toe. I, I'm just going to call it a ring toe. I don't know what it's called. Ring finger. I don't know what else it's called. Ring finger, the uh, ring toe. I had to tape my pinky finger to the ring toe with, like, medical tape. And then I had to, and I had to put a sock over it, and I had to wear this. And I did it all the time. Oh, another story time. Okay, this is, like, I don't know if it was before third grade or not, but, so, I had a bike, okay, we still have this bike, and it's, like, Gary Fisher and that, and we were riding bikes around out front, like, everyone's outside, it was a nice, fun, summery day, it wasn't too hot, because where we live, it's burning hot all the time, and so it wasn't too hot, it wasn't too cold, so it was perfect weather, we're outside, like, me and all my brothers are riding bikes, my parents are sitting down in the camp chair, talking to each other, and that, and I decide, oh, I'm thirsty. So I get off my bike, and I have gears on my bike. Sharp gears. And they didn't have a covering because, I mean, it was a really old bike, and the covering broke off. Like, it was my dad's, I think. Yeah, it was just an old bike. And so I have my gear. This is my fault. All of these stories, all of them are my fault. Okay? And so I dropped the bike. Instead of putting it down, I dropped the bike. And it landed on my foot, and instead of telling my parents that my foot 
was bleeding and gushing out blood. Sorry, that's not just it wasn't gushing, but it was just bleeding in that, and it was deep cuts because I mean I had to get stitches. I literally just went inside, like my parents came okay? and they're like, "What's wrong?" I'm just like, "Oh, I don't feel good," and they're like, "Are you okay?" And they're like, "No, I'm just like, yeah, I'm fine." My little terrible lying mind, and I have paper towels just piled on, and my parents like. My, my my parents are about to like leave because I was watching TV on our computer, like Netflix and that, you know. And they see just like paper towels, like it wasn't that many paper towels. It's just like a jumbled up paper towel of blood, and I had another one on my foot. And so they said, "What happened to your foot?" Like, "Oh my gosh, what happened to your foot?" And I'm just like, "Oh, I just dropped my bike on it, and I removed the paper towel. It's just like a dent in my foot." And then my dad took me to the emergency room where I got a stitch back up. And I even have a scar. Oh, and I have another story time, but I don't even, I, it's another story, not story time. But you can't really see it, but I have a scar here. Yeah. Okay, and then another time, I don't even know what it is. I just have a, a scar here. And that was from like when I was a baby. I forgot what happened, but something happened. Okay, back to the spraining and breaking. So after I broke my toe, so I broke my toe, it's forever, into sixth grade, and I don't know where my, okay, it's sixth grade. Okay, I was running up the stairs, and I tripped, like, cause like, here's my stairs. You turn and then you go down the hallway, and then like, my parents' room's over here. Okay, and I'm, I run up the stairs, I turn really fast, so fast, and I, I was wearing socks and we have carpet, okay, and like carpet upstairs, hardwood downstairs, we're trying to put hardwood upstairs too, we're going, we're getting there. I would probably just mess up my makeup, but did I? I don't know. One second. Okay, so <laughs> I whip around the corner, trip, because like my socks, like sometimes you know how you can like trip on carpet with socks and that makes sense to me I don't know if it makes sense to you but so I'm sitting there and I almost trip I know almost I did trip and I hit my hand on a box and so then I sprained my wrist and I had to get this it was that but like though it wasn't like I hit it and I'm like oh my god oh my god oh my god and I went to my parents and I'm just like help me um I like, I went out and I started hanging out with my friend Katrina, I go follow her, it's Kata Banana. Yeah. Um, and it's Kata Banana. Yeah, I, I said that right. Um, and I went out and I hung out with her for like the whole day. Then I went home and I was going to see if I could have a sleepover with her because I thought maybe I just hurt my hand. And I told my mom and I was just like, my hand really hurts. And she's like, why does your hand hurt? And I said, oh, when I was going upstairs this morning, I tripped and I hit it on a box. And she looked, and it was bruised, like, all of this. It was just, like, bruised. And she's like, oh, my gosh. And she's like, she calls me Bubs. And she's just like, oh, my gosh, Bubs. And she's like, what'd you do? And I'm just like, I just tripped. She's like, you should have, like, shown me or told me about this. And then the next day we went, like, me and my dad went to the doctors, and sure enough, it was brain. So I had to wear this, and then I had to wear this. They had I said three times a day for 20 minutes, and so I would. And then they said if I wanted, once it starts like feeling better in that, I wanted to take it out of this and just relax. I can actually put this on. No, I'll put all these on at the end. Okay, and after that, I don't think I was hurt for a while. Just a few cat scratches and that. Oh, I also got scratched by the pool because I was swimming backwards in our pool. I like smacked my shoulder and my head onto the side of the pool. Okay. A little bit into the future, this is also in sixth grade. I think, I, I don't know if that was in fifth grade. My hand, I, I think it was in sixth grade. I don't know. But, so, <laughs> I don't even know what happened. Like, just one day, like, me and my friends we were just hanging out after school and that, like, like, it was like a Friday or something. Thursday, Friday. I think it was Thursday and we had Friday off. But, I'm just like, my foot hurts. And my friend, Jada, 
go follow her uh, subscribe to her. I think you guys can follow I'm Kata Banana. Go subscribe to Kata Banana and go subscribe to Jada Lawrence. But I hurt my foot and I'm just like my foot hurts and I hurt when I was walking on it like really bad but it's it was hurting for the past few days but I just thought like Oh, there might just be a bruise, or like I'm gonna step on it wrong, it's gonna go away soon. But it wasn't going away, and this is like three days after, like it was hurting in that, like first started hurting. And my friend Jada, like, looked at it, and she, she wants to be a pediatrician when she gets older, and so she was touching. I'm sorry, I keep messing with this, that's really bad. But like, she looked at it, she like poked it, because you know, like when you break it, the doctor's like, does this hurt when I touch it? It's like, yes. Yeah, until <laughs> it's just like it hurts here, and then they press down, and they're like, Does it hurt when I press on it? It's like, Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm staring off over in space, but so she like did that thing, and I'm like, Oh, oh yes, okay, and then she's just like, Betty, I think you broke your foot, and then she, I didn't break it, but I sprained it, and I had to wear this for a couple. The doctors, like, they just said, like, just wear it till it feels better because they didn't know if, like, I could take it off and then hurt it again. So, yeah. And then I have a scar from this because I was walking. I think it was on this foot that I had it on. I don't know. But I was walking up a hill with my friend Katrina, and I kicked my other foot here. Let me see. Yeah, I had it on this foot. I kicked this foot, like, my ankle. And first it was just, like, dead skin. It just looked like I kicked off some skin, but I have a scar from that now. Um, I don't know if there's anything else about broken bones. I have hiccups. Um, I don't. <coughs> yeah. Um, I don't know what else there is to talk about. Oh, yeah. So today is my friend Jada's birthday. So happy birthday. Go uh, follow her. Oh yeah, sorry, I stare off into space. Um, so I don't think there's anything else I'm watching. Uh, so yeah, I don't think there's anything else where I really hurt myself. I don't think. I hurt myself a lot, just so you guys know. I don't like, I purposely hurt myself. I'm just a fragile human being. And so, yeah. Oh, I need to tell you guys how I did this. I already told you about that, but how I broke my toe. Um, so when I had to wear this. When I broke my toe, we were playing tag with my, like it was me and my friend Katrina, and then all these like neighborhood kids, and we were playing tag. And our like, I, it's like a two better part, you know, like two where it leads you from one place to the other. It's like one of those two things, but instead of it being like, just having like three circles or like two or one circle, on the sides and being completely full it was just like there's like little squares everywhere like it's just like cross hatching I don't know it's just like these little squares everywhere on it yeah it's just like lines and then lines into a circle and I was going through and legs first and my toe went into a crack and I basically stubbed it and it hurt really bad I kind of ignored it but then like in the next 10 minutes it really really hurt and so I went and I told my parents and then my parents were just like oh you're, you're probably okay because like I wasn't saying like it feels like it broke it feels like it broke I just said like it just hurts I was just like it just hurts and then they're just like oh you're probably okay you probably just like stopped it and that and I was like okay and then I go and then when I come back like an hour or something later I come back and I'm like my foot hurts and so then we took my friend Katrina home and the next day we went to the doctor's and it was broken. Oh, and then I have another one. So my brother, Aiden, he went and he had, like, I think it was his birthday. Or it was either his birthday or Christmas. I think his birthday. Yeah, his birthday. Birthday. Um, so he got an electric scooter for his birthday and I was always riding on it. And then I, like, because my parents, they were about to go to the store and asked if I could just ride around the electric scooter for a little bit because it was my favorite thing in the whole world. And so I was just riding around and I'm going up the sidewalk, but instead of the thing turning, it didn't turn and it ran. So like, you know when you go up, it has like those little, it's like a rectangle bump thing to keep the rocks in and that at the corner. 
it smashes into that and I fall over and I hit my leg like my leg right here hit that like bump thing and then the rest of me landed in the dirt and so it was all bruised I went inside and I was like first time I was like fine I'm just like mom 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 and I got near the garden and it started hurting more and I just started crying I'm just like mom I started screaming mom as I'm walking to the sorry the camera cut out and it scared me to death um so what are to talk okay so I hit my leg, I was going to I was crying and when I go inside, I'm like, I hit my leg, I hit my leg, I hit my leg, and it hurt really bad, I was crying, and my mom, she saw like, like my mom, because I was wearing shorts, and she saw there's, oh, it was already bruising, like there's already a big bruise on my leg, and she's just like, oh my gosh, and so they took me to the emergency room, they iced it, they asked me questions, they were just like, what happened, what happened? And like, cause they're trying to like get what happened now. I'm still just like shocked. And I'm just like, cause I thought I was gonna die. So, <laughs> and I was just scared. I literally thought I broke something, but I didn't even break it. I just bruised it. And so I had one day of resting. So I missed Monday of school. And then I like, my parents told me like the day I was resting cause they were outside. So I go outside and then they're just like, do you want to get on the scooter? The electric scooter? But I was like, I didn't want to get back on. I thought I was going to die if I got back on. And so I, I'm just like, no. My mom's just like, you can't be scared of getting back on it, okay? And I'm just like, okay. And she's just like, it's just like, if you fall off your bike, you can't get, be afraid to get back on your bike. I'm like, okay. And so then, long story short, uh, the next day I got on the electric scooter again. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's all my injuries. So, yeah. So, subscribe. Leave a like. Comment if you want. Go subscribe to Catabanana. It's C A. It's not C. <laughs> Don't listen to that. It's K A T T A. And then I think space B A N A N A S. Not S. Get rid of the S. But B A N A N A. Yeah, banana. Um, so, cat up banana. Go subscribe to Jada Lawrence, and today is her birthday. Happy birthday. I keep telling her that. Um, and go like all their videos, comment if you want, subscribe to them. And yeah, I think that's it. So, see you in the next video. Bye.